the motivation for doing the FlexCut series uh, comes from the same place as most of uh, the things I've done in, in my career, uh, and that's fun and experimentation. I'd always had flexi discs since I was a kid. I knew you could scratch on them, um, and the flexibility and the weight of them allow for some pretty interesting experiments um, and allow for some pretty crazy sounds. So, yeah, that was it. In this episode of Fresh Press, I review DJ Woody's Flexi Cuts 4. This episode of Fresh Press is sponsored by Magma DJ Bags, the world's leader in high quality, durable DJ bags and equipment. This episode is also sponsored by Mega DJ Center, one of the USA's leading retail outlets for turntablism and DJ culture. Flexi discs have the same size center hole as regular records, but due to their weight and material can feel tighter. Also, the spindle on portable turntables doesn't rotate like a full-size direct drive turntable. If this combination causes any issue with record movement, simply use a regular pen or pencil and push into the hole to widen by the required amount. When you put the record on the actual platter of a portable turntable, you'll notice that it won't move. You need to give that center a little space to kind of catch with your slip mat. So simply putting a pencil through the hole or a pen like I'm doing gives it that extra space so that the record sticks to the platter. My only advice is do it maybe once because if you make the hole too big, the record will shift back and forth causing your needle to skip. Flexi Cuts 4 was produced by DJ Woody out of the UK and was released on his record label, Woodwork. It is a one-sided record, plastic, and definitely could be used for scratch battles or, or even just straight practice. At first I was pretty skeptic about how the record was gonna respond on an actual turntable. So this is where your touch and feel for a vinyl record comes into play. But overall, I was pretty impressed on how this performed. Number one, sound quality on flexi discs are usually pretty suspect. They're, they're mainly for promotional reasons. But Woody and the press did a great job of mastering and making sure that all eight samples on this record come out well through the speakers. Like stated before, it really comes down to the content on the record. And the content on Flexi Cuts 4 and his entire Flexi Cuts series is superb. Woody is a world-class turntablist, and you wouldn't expect less from him. So for all you portable turntablists out there, this definitely should go in your bag. On the next episode of Fresh Press, I review DJ Vec and Fresh Kill's seven inch break record, Fresh Cuts. Want to be featured on the next episode? If you already have the next episode's record, send us a 30 second to one minute clip of you practicing and we'll post it on the show. Also, don't forget to use the hashtag DJ City Fresh Press. Thanks for watching. <laughs>